All right, everybody. I am, uh, I'm in West Virginia. I'll give you a look-see where I'm at. I'm in a little bird called Mason Town. I'm going to, uh, explore some rural West Virginia in this video. But first, I'll show you where I'm at. Uh, you see Morgantown over here. That's where the University of West Virginia is. But I am going to kind of explore this little corner of rural West Virginia. Actually, I'm going to stay below the interstate there. Uh, give you an idea where I'm at. This is Pennsylvania and this is Maryland. So, uh, that's where I'm going to be driving around. Um, I got to tell you guys, West Virginia is beautiful. Wow, we drove, uh, we started in Huntington and drove through Charleston uh, up to uh, Morgantown and it was gorgeous. All the towns uh, kind of tucked in the mountain crevices there. Always a river or a creek. Absolutely beautiful. The last time we were here in West Virginia, it was winter and it looked very different than it does now. It is just gorgeous here in the summer but anyway I'm gonna take a little tour of uh, some of the small towns here in rural West Virginia so uh, that is what you're gonna be seeing and it's an abandoned trailer here nobody living in that Uh-oh, chickens. <laughs> yeah, you know you're in the country then. Uh, chickens uh, on the road. Okay, I'm uh, entering Kingwood now. Um, wow, look at that. That is quite a pool setup, isn't it? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Let's take a drive into a neighborhood. Now, this in a nutshell is what it's like to drive in much of West Virginia. You got hills everywhere. Almost all the homes are situated on hills. So uh, it's really, for me, an interesting thing coming uh, from flat Texas. that dog barking away I don't think he's barking at me though I think I'm going to uh, go on on back up to the road and head back into town though just want to see this quiet little area huh. look at those uh, four I guess they're trees, but uh, looks like they, uh, they're not alive. Such an interesting place, isn't it? Look at that tiny little house, two stories. It's like, can you picture what it must look like inside that house? So fascinating looking. Anyway, uh, and look at all this traffic. But I'm going to head into uh, the main city part of Kingwood now. Okay, just uh, continuing on into Kingwood. Soaking up the sights. Checking out some of the homes here. And the folks who are out on their porches just hanging out. A lot of beautiful homes here. Yeah, I'm almost in downtown, but I saw this. I want to stop and take a look at it. With the church bells in the background. But, um, look at this. A little moment in time, huh? This old gas station. 
Uh, they have smartly kept in uh, like um, museum condition. That is something, isn't it? That is pretty awesome. I'm impressed. It is Sunday morning, by the way. Just, just in case you're wondering. <laughs> but this looks like uh, the downtown. So I'm gonna go driving through there right now. Well, let's go see what downtown Kingwood looks like. This is a little bit bigger town. Uh, almost 3,100 people here. So it might see a little bit uh, more stuff. Hmm. I think I'm just going to go straight through the light here and turn around. Yeah, that is an old Rexall Drugs. You see them occasionally. Hmm. That's a cool old building across the street there, though, isn't it? Former bank, it looks like. Uh, uh, now is an attorney's office. This is uh, West Virginia. You're going to be driving on some hills. Anyway, I'm going to uh, make my way to my next small town. Uh, it's called Rollsburg. Uh, I am in what looks like a former trailer graveyard, or a current trailer graveyard, I should say. Nobody lives in those. Look how <laughs> rickety that is. I mean, that wouldn't take much of a wind to blow those over. That's crazy. Siri is telling me that I need to make a right to get to the downtown. It's not going to be big. In 900 feet, turn left onto Poplar Street. According to Australian Siri, it's 900 feet away. So here we are. Main Street, Rollsburg. Wow. I'm going to have to make a pass through this. Looky here. Huh. I'm gonna go this way and then turn around. And get another look. Alright, let's take a look from this way, shall we? Wow, look at there. pretty much it. It is a very small town. A lot of character here though. Look at this Main Street Garden. Oh, nice. Wow. That looks like a lot of people are in church. Catholic Church founded 1862. Look at that. Huh. Town just kind of ends right here. <laughs> Look at these beautiful old homes. How cool. Alright, folks, that's Rollsburg. 
There is no phone service here. Look at that on the left hand corner there. I'm trying to plug in uh, the next town and I can't. I'm driving blind. <laughs> yeah, no internet, or I'm sorry, no phone service in Rollsburg. How about that? Yeah, let me give you another glimpse from this direction. That is something, isn't it? I mean, this town is just sitting right here in the mountains. Wow. All right, I'm gonna have to try to figure out how to get to my next town. I'm gonna have to look at a map. Well, I consulted my map and I'm on my way now. Uh, I am still in Rollsburg. That's just amazing visually. I gotta tell you guys. Let me see if I can, uh, yeah. See the couple streets of the town. Something. Wow, well, got us a little uh, graveyard here. Let's see if I back the camera around. You can see the town pretty, pretty good from this way. Picturesque, isn't it? Well, still no phone service yet. But I believe I'm heading in the right direction. Just checking out the sights. See that Confederate flag? Wow. Ah. Not sure where I am now. This doesn't even show up on the map. That says Buffalo Green Bar. Hmm. Oh, across the uh, street here. I don't know if you can see that sign, but it says coal for sale. Well, I guess if you want to buy some coal, that's where you go. All right, I am turning onto Frog Hollow Road, it says. Frog Five Hollow Road. Miles, turn right onto Bank Street. All right, so uh, Tunnelton, here we come. And wow, this is a tiny little road. I mean, look at this, woo! This should be interesting. I mean, this is barely wide enough for two cars. Ah. And the sights. Wow. It's an amazing road, isn't it? Basically halfway up into these mountains. Oh yeah, this is... Wow, something to see. What must... Turn right onto Bank Street, then arrive at your destination. All right, Australian Siri. Uh, it's hard to imagine what life must be like here. Uh, there's only about 300 people in this town. So there's uh, not going to be any grocery stores, or if there are, they're going to be tiny. Wow, look at that over there. Definitely got to go down there and take a look. Got to somehow get across these uh, <laughs> railroad tracks, though. Looks like uh, I can get across right here. Not across, but under. Wow. All right, let's go check it out over there. Oh.
pretty sure those are not street legal. <laughs> that was me as a dumb kid though, I'm not gonna lie. Lived on motorcycles. Anyway, I'm gonna go up here and take a right. This is something. Oh, very steep hill and a really rough road. That's how I can des describe this to you. Yeah, it's gonna go up here. Looks like the town ends right up here. And uh, you know, I'll turn around. Wow. Beware of dog. I bet. Looks like we got a truck driver right here. Yeah, and that's pretty much the end of the town, at least in this direction. I'm gonna turn around. about that, huh? If I can back up on out of here. Have a... Ha. I'm going to head back down. <laughs> I've got a uh, fire hydrant right there. You think that's operational? Hard to say. Man, this, this is a rough road. Uh, oh, I've got one little bar there, so maybe I can plug in the next town. Yeah, I, I wanna give you another look here, though. This is something. Uh, hmm. Is that a tub? Hmm. Showing you the other side. Wow. Well, all right. <laughs> oh, man. I just put two uh, new tires on this thing. I am definitely glad I did that. Wow. All right, I'm heading to the next town of Newburgh. Uh, I'm about to get on Raccoon Valley Road. In 4.9 miles, turn left onto North Mountaineer Highway. All right, thank you, Australian Siri. Yeah. This one might even be a worse road than the last one. <laughs> Woo! Now I'm continuing my drive uh, to uh, Newburgh. <laughs> Decided to stop and take a quick look at this. Oops! Something happened there. I mean, it looks like the house just slid off the hill. Wow. Alright, it is desolate up here. Newburgh. Looks like uh, quite the place. Be right onto Austin Road. Yeah, Australian series. Well, she's telling me where to go, isn't she? Here we go. This looks like a town. Wow. 
Chuck's store. He sells gas, too. Hey, look at this. I think I'm just going to keep going straight through. I'm just going to head into town here. Actually, I think I'm already out of the city center. See some houses up there on the hills. Let me turn around, give you a view from the other side. Newburgh, West Virginia. Huh. Yeah, that needs some work, doesn't it? Got some pretty awesome houses here. Yeah, I'm going to turn around. Show you what it looks like the other direction. Okay, so I've turned around and uh, show you what's up here. Uh, definitely a mountain town. To go up there and take a look too. There are some really nice houses up there. Huh. So I'm gonna head in here. Uh, First National Bank used to be. See I love this building. Chuck store one stop shopping. That is Really awesome building. Let's see what else we can see up here. Well, the railroad comes up here. Huh. I mean, look at these homes. They could use a little uh, work, but none of them small climb up this hill it's a lugging nah just kidding a Bronco can handle it easily all right so uh, yeah let's take a look from up here hopefully the camera is capturing it because it is pretty freaking awesome view of this old mountain town of Newburgh huh. this is maybe an old school wow. another nice view beautiful house there uh, we got something of a mishap here though it looks like Wow Oh, somebody's got a cool uh, above ground pool there. <laughs> yeah, turn the Bronco off. To just enjoy the silence of this honestly lovely little town. Way up here in the mountains. In rural West Virginia. There's a church right there. You can hear some people talking outside of that. But there's no wind. Really quiet and nice. Not a bad place to uh, retire, or if you are a person who can work from home, what a great place. Hmm. Yeah, I'm uh, still in this town of Newburgh. <laughs> Lovely house here. But oh boy, look at this steep. Uh, grade coming down can you imagine this in the winter yeah forget about it just gonna drive real slow 
How nice, huh? Oh, I didn't put my seatbelt on. All right, all right, all right. That was something. I kind of love this little town. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Uh, Newburgh, West Virginia. Population 275, it says. That's what my notes say. Nice, very nice. I'm just outside Grafton. Uh, no HOA here. <laughs> Wow, look at that old house. See that corner room? That was a beautiful house at one time. I hate to see it in this kind of disrepair. Huh. Alright, I'm in the small town of Thornton. Oh, we got ourselves a bathing beauty here. Wow. Got a few uh, empty homes here. A uh, real tiny place, as you can see. Uh, continuing through Thornton, just outside of Grafton. Quite little place. Got a little bit of uh, neglect here and there. Okay, I'm a couple miles outside of Grafton. Checking out the sites. There's a building here. Uh, it says it's open. Hard to say what that uh, business is. <laughs> but um, maybe it's some kind of secret bar. Yeah. Well, yeah, all right. On to Grafton I go. All right, I have arrived in Grafton. Wow, what a town, I can already tell. It's a little bit bigger. There's about, uh, I wanna say 3,000 people. My notes blew somewhere. But wow, uh, look at this. Built up here in the hills. Turn right onto St. John Street, then turn right onto West Main Street. All right, well, Australian Siri has instructed me to make a right hand turn right here and go into that. Let's get a good look at this. Holy cow. At the stop sign, turn right onto West Main Street, then the destination is on your right. All right, well, I think we need. Siri has helped us all we need. Look at this. Huh. I think we'll cut a left. Drive down this way a little. And then turn around. Look at that building right there. I have to pull into this parking lot. Holy cow. Let me turn around here. What is this? Is it empty? I hope not. It's in bad disrepair though look at the uh, lamps there on the right side they're missing the bulbs or the globes 
Yeah, fascinating town here. Okay, I'm on the main street here of Grafton. Look at that. Now this is a town with character. <laughs> well, you look at all this. A big old mural. There's the town. There. I know what that old building is. Wow. Now that's downtown right there, that main street. I'm kind of above town here. Well, a street above anyway. That is something. I hope you could see all that. See the homes on the side of the mountain there? The layout of this town is... Ah, it's just beautiful the way it sits in the mountains. Beware of dog. I see that a lot up here. Huh. See the tops of the buildings? this house right here is that the backyard I don't see a road to this to this home here how do you even get to it look at that you guys seeing what I'm seeing I mean there's no driveway uh, no driveway there I guess they just park across the street here same with this one that's the way down to that house I have to walk down the stairwell or stairway and yeah there's wow that's something huh i see a road down there now i wonder if i can get to it okay yeah there is a road down here okay yeah because these are these houses that we're just looking at Look at that house. Can you imagine having a front yard that looks like that? That's this person's front yard. How do you even mow that? <laughs> that has got to be so difficult. Wow, this is their yards. See, that house was once really beautiful. It's in bad shape now, but it was once really beautiful. That's the craziest thing. Yeah, I am uh, making my way back into downtown, it looks like. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, end the video here because I can already tell that lengthwise, it is getting out of control. Okay, like I said earlier, uh, I'm gonna end the video here. It's um, getting way too long, I can tell. Uh, I was gonna explore another 10 towns or so, but um, yeah, you'd have like a two hour long video then. So, <laughs> um, this is it. The wife and I will be going to Morgantown, West Virginia next. Uh, that will be the next video. So be looking for that.